Hopefully by now you are starting to get an awareness of the importance of controlling the degree of ionization of a component. And this brings us back to pH and we'll introduce buffers at this stage. A buffer is a solution which is resistant to pH change. For a buffer, a little acid or a little base can be added to the solution, but the pH will remain okay. constant. There is no animation in this page, but the equilibrium equation should look familiar to you. The example shown is an acetate buffer. An acetic acid is a weak acid. A weak acid is an acid which does not fully dissociate readily. That is, there will be some component in the ionic form and some in the non-ionic form. A buffer consists of an equal molar amount of the acid and its conjugate base. In this example, that would mean an equal amount of acetic acid is mixed with, say, sodium acetate. Therefore, if an acid is added to this solution, this is soaked up by the acetate base, and if a base is added, this will be soaked up by the acetic acid.